escape. In any city, in any country, go to any park you can get yourself to. Sit on a bench and watch as people pass around you. Every five minutes, whisper, I'll wait until your return. Eventually, somewhere in your view of the park, you'll hear a soft whistle and notice something unusual. A small area will appear to wrap in on itself and someone will emerge from nowhere. Approach this person and ask, Where do you hide from them? The person will look at you, pretending not to understand what you asked. Repeat your question and he will walk to the nearest coffee shop. You must follow this person and sit with him, because if you lose sight of the person, you will never have another chance to meet the holder. After the person orders and finishes his coffee in complete silence, he will get up and walk away, leaving behind a sip of his drink in the cup. Take the cup, enter the shop's bathroom, and lock the door. Finish the drink, and your vision will warp the same way the person appeared out of nowhere. The world will turn black and fade into nothingness. When your senses return to you, you will be standing on the end of a dock, facing a small island in the middle of a nameless ocean. It will be pleasant, and you may forget what you are looking for. But be careful, for you will die alone on this island without the object you are looking for. Walk quickly to the only small cabin on the island, for it will quickly become apparent that the water is slowly rising up the island, to forever drown whoever is unlucky enough to be on the island at the time. Do not look out to the ocean for you will be pulled out to sea by a giant wave and left to fend for yourself for the rest of time. Upon entering the cabin, you will notice the bodies of those who could not escape the inviting atmosphere of the island. On the bed will be a sleeping figure. Nothing will wake him besides the question, Where can I hide from them? The figure, the holder of the escape, will awaken and tell the story of every seeker who could not hide from those who hunted them, sending a chill through your entire being. As this story continues, the shack will start to deteriorate, the sand will turn to hot ash, and the water will turn to blood, more quickly rising up the island than before. When the holder finishes his story, he will disintegrate, leaving behind a small whistle, and you'll notice a shackle around your ankle, locking you to the floor. The blood will rise up above your head, and you'll be forced to drown in it, imagining the horrors that they inflicted on the other seekers. If you awaken in the coffee shop from what onlookers think was a nap, consider yourself lucky, as you've passed the holder's test and now possess Object 326, the whistle. Its power will transport you to the safety of the island, but each time you visit, time will pass more quickly in the real world, and you'll be more tempted to stay for the rest of your days. That whistle is object 326 out of 538. You cannot escape your destiny. You can only delay it.